In this lecture series, our objective is to find new perspectives about our media use. In our first unit, we focus on the negative effects media have on consumers. There are obvious benefits to social media use, fast, convenient, updated constantly, and sometimes more reliable than humans who can make errors. The cons of constant media consumption by your generation are not immediately as apparent as the benefits. Teenagers and young adults have developed into an overwhelmingly introverted generation. With a variety of avenues to choose, these age groups have only grown up knowing a digital world. Therefore, sometimes they do not see any other way to communicate with others. Primarily, it is social media, texting, and entertainment media that teenagers and young adults allow to interfere with human connection. In her education article, author Diana Coyle points at how severe of an impact media plays on the development of communication skills. Many teenagers spend time with their friends, but they are subsequently alone while together because they stay glued to media. If one cannot communicate without a phone, can humans really develop meaningful relationships with one another? Love remains a possibility, but committed, undistracted love is often far and few between because of new social behaviors. What happens to the human capacity to love when two people are distanced by a screen? We will be taking a close reading of Sherry Turkle's book, Alone Together, to find some answers to these questions and to form a thesis about this standpoint.